Okay, we're so excited to be at the Clearwater Lake in Falls Creek Campgrounds here. A little bit of our route today from Clearwater, about a 70 kilometer drive. Uh, we started in Vancouver, so um, of course we hit uh, Kamloops for gas and some supplies. Uh, we took what I call the back route, uh, Cache Creek, um, and you know, through Spence's Bridge uh, and Lytton. Uh, basically all the, all the way from Vancouver on the uh, back road. Um, low heat highway um, took us <laughs> a good eight hours to get here from Vancouver um, here's the look at the drive into the park again 70 kilometers uh, through the park uh, here you can see the map of the two campgrounds they're basically connected so um, very convenient if you have friends at uh, one of the two campsites or they're basically um, you know the same so here we are at our campground, Clearwater Lake Campground. You know, we chose this one uh, because they have a boat launch, which I'm gonna show uh, some stuff about that later. Uh, but they had a, a small store, uh, a restaurant at the picnic area where we could get ice cream and actually got a really good uh, iced coffee there on a hot day. So we really liked um, this crap campground when we were booking and uh, just a little bit closer to the picnic area. So here we are cruising in again um, a map of the two uh, campgrounds side by side uh, about 80 campgrounds within the two campsites connected from the uh, falls um, walkway which I'm going to show in a second so great campsites Again, we really love the picnic area um, at uh, our Clearwater Lake campground. It was the only area where we could sort of dip our feet and cool off a bit. The rest of the areas were really fast running water, so I'd be careful, especially if you had a toddler's young ones. Here's, here we are, you know, driving through our campground. Like many provincial campgrounds, lush, uh, very private, lots of big trees. Um, so we really love our provincial campgrounds. I really loved the new outhouses, running water, recycling, and garbage, so that was really convenient. No showers, but nice to have these uh, facilities. Again, the other campgrounds right next door, you go over this cool creek. Look at that water rushing. Big uh, snowpack in 2022 so all the waters are are moving faster than they usually would here we are zipping down to the other falls creek campground to check it out you can see how close it is again you know big big open uh you know private uh, campgrounds very much uh very relaxing. Here's here's a look at the map of um, the Falls Creek Campground, about 40 campgrounds. Same facilities as the other one. And look at that, 67 <laughs> kilometers from Clearwater. So a bit of a drive into the park, but so worth it. Very beautiful. Here's a look at the entrance to the Falls Creek Campground. So they're both uh, amazing campgrounds and we had a great time nice uh, clear skies at night for stargazing and campfires so we give it a thumbs up great campgrounds okay I'm so glad that I went to the boat launch to check out Clearwater Lake because it was incredible um, so, so beautiful. Check this view out. It goes on and on and on. Um, you know, boat launch, bring your boat. I imagine the fishing would be amazing or just the exploring and being cool. Uh, this lake uh, connects to another lake. Um, and I believe there's campsites throughout the lake that are boat access only. So I'm really glad that I... Um, drove about three kilometers from our campsite up to the boat launch to show you this pristine uh, lake. So if you have a boat, bring it to the campground and you can have a really amazing um, vacation. 
Here's a little look at the lake. 